What is up my wonderful people, my favorite fellow earthlings in the whole world, all of my subscribers. What's going on? Today's video, I'm going to be taking you through a full day of what I have been dealing with every day for like the past two weeks, which is basically running the junk removal business and at the same time getting the rage room up and ready for business. So today was a pretty successful day. The junk removal side of things made over a thousand dollars which is great that's um a little below our goal we're trying to make two thousand dollars a day in the junk removal business uh, but we have been averaging about six jobs a day today we did do uh, i think we did three estimates which were over twenty five hundred dollars a piece those three estimates each um, and then yesterday i did an estimate for like six thousand uh, an estimate for like 2000 the day before that I did an estimate for 7000 so if some of these jobs start rolling in if we nail some of these jobs and if we get the um, the jobs put in the system then we're gonna we're gonna hit well over two thousand dollars on average per day a week but like I said we've been averaging six jobs a day whether it be an estimate or a pickup or a drop-off or a junk removal and uh, that's pretty amazing. My boys have been doing a great job out there. So thank you, Richard. Thank you, Isaac. Thank you, Brandon. I appreciate you guys so much. This video, like I said, is going to be a, a, a day in the life of how um, and what I'm doing every day to keep things going and to get the rage room ready. So without further ado, I'm going to take you back to this morning when I first started filming this video. And I'm fixing to uh, start editing it. And... Uh, Please do me a favor guys, hit that like button, subscribe to me, and hit the notifications bell if you haven't already. That way you can be notified every time I put up a new video. Without further ado, let's get into it. What is up guys? Wow, it's been such a long time. If you don't remember me, my name is Austin Hustler Hires, your favorite fellow earthling. And I know I haven't given away a prize in a while, so today I'm going to be giving away, or this week rather, I'm going to be giving away this thing right here. And I have not been following my YouTube schedule because we've been so freaking busy with the junk removal and the rage room business that I just have been slacking on YouTube. So I'm sorry for that and all of you that like to watch me on a regular. Here goes a video today and it's basically just going to be a day in the life of what I've been doing every single day. Uh, since I started this rage room up and um, we're not even open yet. I plan on opening on the 15th, maybe the 17th if it prolongs, um, if it goes on that long. But uh, anyway, this is the prize of the week, guys. Go ahead and take a good look at that. I'm going to go ahead and uh, say you can put the keyword flash in the comments down below. Hit the like button, make sure you're subscribed, and I will choose one of you guys to win this prize. I have no idea what it is, but you can definitely win it if you enter the keyword flash, subscribe, and hit the like button. Let's go ahead, let's go ahead and get on with the video today. So it's about 6.45 in the morning, guys, and as you can tell, I'm, I'm a little tired. And if you can't tell, now you know, I'm a little tired. <laughs> Been working a lot, a lot of long days, and uh, that's just what it takes to get shit done. So the boys are getting the truck hooked up right now. They're gonna go out and do a pickup this morning. Then they have three junk removals and a dumpster rental today. So the junk removal business is staying busy, pulling in a lot of money. Um, I think we're having an average of like five or six jobs per day right now. I've been having to go out with them. <laughs> it swerved. <laughs> All right, we found some uh, cool, some cool artifacts at this last job we did yesterday. Um, this is like a old penny. Um, it's one of those wheat pennies. It's actually a 1937 wheat penny. It may be worth some money on eBay. Um, and we found a bunch of other old coins and dollar bills and stuff at this job we did yesterday. Um, yeah, so he just tossed that at me real quick. That's what I like about my boys. They're always honest about the stuff that we find. And, um, you know, if we find something that's worth a lot of money, 
and I end up selling it for a lot of money. I always give them a good chunk of the money to uh, for my appreciation to them for not only finding this stuff but being honest with me that they found the stuff. Um, so yeah, there they are, leaving for the day. Brandon's putting the lock on the gate, and um, they're out of here. They're gonna be gone all day, probably till about four o'clock today. I am going to get this mattress and stuff loaded into the dumpster that I have right here. And there's actually a refrigerator and a stove in there I need to kick out of the back of the dumpster so my scrap guy can come pick it up. It is gonna be another long day here. After I do that, I'm gonna go to the dump and get rid of the rest of the trash. I'm gonna take that mattress that's back there, take that mattress right there and uh, dump that in the dumpster as well. Take it to the dump, like I said, empty it out, um, probably come back and drop the trailer off, pick my family up, and we're gonna go down to the rage room, finish, uh, I'm gonna finish building one of the barn doors. I, I finished one set of barn doors, which I'll show you when I get there, and then I'm gonna finish the uh, second barn door today. We gotta finish putting some vinyl up, and we gotta figure out uh, what kind of system we're gonna do to take payment for everything in the shop, but we are literally almost done with it, and I'll show you guys when I get there. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and uh, get on with the day. Those of you that know I got a dog, a new dog for Christmas, this is him. He's uh, ginormous right now. <laughs> Say hello, Onyx. Yes, that's my big Onyx. He is a very big dog, and he's going to get even bigger. Compared to Patches, he's a freaking giant. He can literally step right over her. <laughs> And uh, yeah, so that's an update on my big boy, Onyx. Good morning, son. Good morning, Daddy. You ready to do a day in the life on YouTube with Daddy? Mm-hmm. All right, let's do it. But good first, morning. good morning, hugs. Ooh. So, yeah, that's my favorite part of the day is getting my good morning hugs. Oh, come on, give my good morning hugs. Oh, oh, I love you, son. Where's Ember at? Sleeping. Sleeping still. She's still snoozing like always. <laughs> let's, let's wake her up. Good morning, sleepyhead. Can I have a hug? I love you. I love you too. Let's get this day over with, alright? Let's make some money and get this rage room set up. You tired still? Mm-mm. Alright, good. Let's go. Alright, my next favorite part of the day, my good morning kiss. And obviously some coffee and hopefully some eggs and bacon. Some good old eggs and bacon. To start the day out with. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. give my scrap metal guy a ring. He'll come by and pick all the stuff up. I probably should have put gloves on, but I'm still at the office so I can wash my hands real quick. All right, I know that wasn't 20 seconds of washing, but ain't nobody got time for that. Two beds right there. I'm gonna take them off, throw them in the dumpster. This is the type of stuff you'll be able to smash if you come to our rage room, fellow Earthlings rage room, located in DeLand off of 15A, opening up probably next week. I don't quite know yet, so don't hold me to that, but we're gonna have dressers, ceramics, glass, all kinds of stuff to break, mirrors, pictures, literally everything that you can smash, and uh, we're gonna have lots of fun. Let's go, baby. 
If you're still here and you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Hit the notifications bell so you can be notified every time I put up a new video. Also, hit that like button for me so that I can be pushed further up in the algorithm and show this video to everybody who's going to love it. Alright, so for the first part of the video, I realized that my, I just realized that my camera was on manual focus and not auto focus, so some parts might be blurry in the beginning. I appreciate you sticking through those parts. Getting the kids loaded into the truck now, and we're headed out to the rage room. Alright, so we're here at the fellow Earthlings rage room, guys. Go ahead and get this door unlocked. Let's get our day started. Some lights on in here, bada bing bada boom. So as you can see, I've got the uh, big sign that we're hanging above the building started and I'm gonna finish that up today. I've got my vinyl printed out over there. I'm gonna go ahead and get the phone hooked up because this phone is not working. So I, I brought another one today. I'm gonna get that hooked up real quick, first thing. All right guys, so I've got our, our Let It Go junk removal phone right there set up and see if I can fix that blur. I don't know why it keeps going to, there we go. It keeps going to manual focus for some reason. Um, all right, so we've got the phone system hooked up for our 833 number you can see right there, 833-833. We have three lines there, in case three people call. Hey guys. Hey guys. Dad is recording. All right. I want you guys to have fun, all right? This is this is it. This is it, fellow Earthlings. This is uh, this is my family. They bring some toys. They're gonna be here like pretty much hanging out and playing all day. I'm gonna get this sign finished. Um, basically, vinyl it up, and now we'll be able to answer all the calls and schedule all the jobs here at the shop. We don't have to worry about missing a call. Um, so that's really good. And she's getting the computer set up so we can you know put all the jobs into workies from there. And this is the vinyl that I have to basically peel off and finish the sign with, so let me go ahead and get that done. She's selling her first job in the rage room. Awesome. All right, guys. So we've got our we've got our signs up there on the front. See that bottom right-hand corner, and also we're displayed on the LED. And then we've got our sign up top, baby. Look how big that is. Also, I just wanted to interrupt this video to tell you real quick, we haven't even opened our rage room yet. And I made our first $100 in the rage room today. I sold a little like uh, suede chair and I sold two rocker chairs to the landlord and his buddy today. So I just wanted to interrupt the video to let you guys know I made my first $100 in the, in the storefront part of the shop. And, uh, and we haven't even opened yet. So anyway, back to the video. In this scene, I had my microphone turned off, so I'm just gonna do a quick voiceover. My son was helping me drill the holes, and uh, basically I was putting the screws in, and this is the back side of the door that you're looking at here. We got it put together, we got the rollers put on, and we got it hung up. Super awesome. Okay guys. So this is the progress we made today. We got all this area cleaned up out here. Looking good. Barn doors are up. That big barn door we finished building. My son helped me build it and uh, got it hung up. It rolls nicely. So that way we basically just rolled that door out of the way and we could bring the furniture in and out that big roll up door back there instead of bringing in this little tiny door here. Um, we managed to get a bunch of smashed bottles, smashable bottles, smashable bottles. Um, we've got furniture, we painted some of our tools, we're going to paint them all black. We got our exit signs up, one right there, we got an exit sign right there, that one was already there, and we got our exit sign there. So we can be compliant with, you know, inspectors and all that good stuff. 
Also, in this room here, I got my got my rage helmets all set up. I'll turn the light on here. Got the rage helmets all set up. We got the basically the laundry basket. Whenever um, people are done using these, they will take them off and put them in there. And we're actually going to have a stackable washer and dryer right here, a small stackable. We're going to wash and dry all of our coveralls right here in house so we don't have to go anywhere. We have the hookups right there for it. So that's one of the next things. Um, I'm going to get this TV hung in here or somewhere in here. Um, so that basically we're going to use this TV to play the safety um, guidelines and regulations. I'm going to make a YouTube video on it and then I'm going to go ahead and play that for every person so I don't have to come in here and explain it to every person coming in. After they watch that video, they can earn their annual pass to rage out whenever they want. In here, I got these glass cases nice and cleaned up and um, they're looking really good so I'm going to put some vinyl on them, you know, saying rage room. Um, and basically, you know, I got that big vinyl sign up and we're going to go ahead and get out of here for the day. Got a little something on the lens there. I don't know how that got on there. Hopefully that's a little clearer. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and go home and get out of here for the day. Um, Osiris is pretty tired, right, from working with Daddy all day. Mommy's been out going and getting glass bottles from the bars. and Ember and Magnus have been helping out all day. So we're going to go home, relax the rest of the day, come back tomorrow, and get right back at it. So that's the end of the video guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video and that some of you that are in Florida come by and visit me. Woo! This place is going to be freaking awesome. Have a we'll catch you next good time. time. Yeah, say that again. Have a smashing good time.